Hi, good morning. My name is Albert Kirshner. I am a citizen and resident of the Commonwealth of Pennsylvania. I supported Donald Trump in the 2016 election. I donated to his campaign. In September of 2017, I was in a bar, which is now closed, called The Tops in Derry Township, Harrisburg with my mother. It was a Friday night. And at that time, I looked up to the video screens where they usually have uh, baseball and football. And I saw a group of people in Charlottesville, Virginia that were waving Nazi flags, Confederate flags, and chanting a variety of Nazi-inspired propaganda. Later on that evening, a young lady by the name of Heather Heyer was run over by a Nazi right-wing extremist. One waited for the president to come out and say something. The quote from President Obama, who I did not vote for on two occasions, how hard is it to come out and say something such as Nazis are bad? Trump never did that. Trump would have us believe that sacrifices in the American military are made for him. He would have us believe that when he says, quote, the military is with me, he's speaking for the entire military establishment. He's speaking for the Pentagon. All of us Americans somewhere have an ancestor that fought and died for this country. When my grandfather stormed the beach at Normandy, he did not do so for Donald Trump. When my ancestors fought in Union Blue and spilled their blood down in Gettysburg, they did not do so for Donald Trump. They did so for the U.S. Constitution. Donald Trump is against the U.S. Constitution. I tell you that as a lawyer who has studied it not once, but three times. I hold, in fact, two advanced degrees in Constitution law. I'm voting for Joe Biden. There is not a choice. If you wish to defend the rule of law in this country, Trump has to go. If you wish to defend the Constitution, Trump has to go.